we go. Hey. Uh, welcome back. It's legitimately 8.30, almost 8.40 in the morning. Now a lot of you people are saying, whoa, 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 <laughs> Frank, ta hit the brakes. This is not hit the brakes, this is time out. This is hit the brakes. I don't know why I have hand brakes. Hit the, you know, you get the. I um, don't drink coffee. However, I had some really cool people send me some really, well, I, I haven't opened the box yet. I presume really cool stuff. They sent me a cool box. What am I gonna do? Well, I have a wife. I'm gonna make her a coffee drink. Now, whoa, I pumped the brakes again. At the time of recording, she's pregnant. But she can have a little coffee. She can have a little espresso. She can have a little, a little, mwah, mwah, a little, mwah, mwah. so our friends at Fire Department Coffee sent me this box. So I'm gonna open this box. So something that's pretty cool, that you see veteran owned. Um, I did some research on Fire Department Coffee. Veteran owned. Uh, they're run by active and retired fire uh, firefighters, men and women, and um, a lot of their proceeds go to helping, you know, uh, I believe, veterans. Uh, so uh, I would definitely check it out. But So we're going to open this box. Open it up. We got a hat. There's my wife. By the way, no pants on. Right here, <laughs> pantless. Yeah, well, hold on. How are you doing? Uh, so we got a hat. Fire Department coffee, very cool, very chic, very stylish. Yeah. Look at that. It fits like a motherfucking glove. Yeah. Wow, thank you. Mug, a travel mug, and bottle. Oh, there's a bottle opener on the bottom. So if you're like me and you're a degenerate, Fire Department handcrafted coffee, small batch, probably roasted, right in the heart of America, baby. <laughs> Shell back espresso. Oh, there's a little. Look at this. That's a pretty cool logo. I don't know, should I do the coffee or the espresso? Hey! Hey, babe! Should I do coffee or espresso? I'm gonna espress it up. Brewing two tablespoons, uh, six fluid ounces of cold unfiltered water. First of all, I got this pretty cool little brewer thing right here. It's electronic, I can set the temperature, boom. My wife is one of those freakazoids out there that likes Starbucks. She likes to walk in and speak in tongues. That's why we're going to do a drink that she likes to get, but we're going to do it with the good stuff. So she sent me in there one day and she's like, can you do me a favor? I'm like, yeah, sure, babe. What do you want? Anything for you. You're the love of my life. And she's like, all right, take it easy. You're being a little hostile right now. And I'm saying, how am I being hostile? And she saw me sweating and I was like, she said, give me a double shaken espresso cold brew sweet foam oat milk. But she told me the ingredients. There's brown sugar syrup, there's oat milk, there's cinnamon, and there's coffee or espresso. I uh, got some oatly oat milk. Look, it smells, it smells like oats. Which I didn't know oats had nipples. But this right here is brown sugar syrup. So what do you do? Equal parts sugar, equal parts water. In this situation, it's like three cups of brown sugar and three cups of water. And you boil it. You boil it, you boil it, and then you let it chill, and it gets like a little syrup. This is the thing, I don't drink coffee, I love the smell. And that smells delicious. So I got French press right here, boom. And I know what you're thinking. Frank, you're a grown man, why do you have boobs? I'll tell you this, <laughs> who hates boobs? More boobs are better, so boobs on men, also sweet. One, two, let's close it because the, the Coffee people I know, they say like, yo, listen, like you want to like seal it as quick, as tight as you can. And I'm like, hey, yo. And they're like, yeah, tight. And I'm like, okay, take it easy. And they look at me shaking. They're tight. Let's pour it in. Now it says to let it roast for four minutes. All right, this is going. We still got three minutes left. Good apple. Top three apples, you ready? Gala. Fuji number two. Pink ladies number three. What's up? Night. Open this bad boy. Maybe like half a tablespoon, right? Two, one. All right, done. Let's press this. 
Now we're going coffee in. All right, oat milk's in. And we give it a little stir. Wham, bam, thank you. Dad. Hey, babe, I need you to come taste test this immediately. Rover, why are you serious? Like you just, <laughs> if you fuck this up, they're gonna know. Hey babe, do you mind coming in? Oh wait, I was facing that way before. <laughs> babe, come on down. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Out. I can't, I've been told not to look at her, so I'm just gonna face this way. Oh, that's, all right, that's my baby. What is what? This? The fucking cocaine, oh, oh god. <laughs> do you like the drink? Yes. Is it good? Yes. Do you like the coffee? Yes! Please. And by the way, all the people last week were like, you fucking filmed it the wrong way. I know I did. Uh, but it smells good, I'll tell you that. Go check out Fire Department Coffee. They got some really cool stuff, they're really cool people. And uh, let me know what you want me to take on next week. Goodbye.